Yo, what's up guys? <clears throat> uh good afternoon to everybody. Um <clears throat> this video is called Uh Love Don't Cost a Thing. And um I don't know where it just came to me when I was taking a shower, so bear with me. Um uh, my top is come some ain't came lately, or they come to me at work, but this came to me while I was in the shower. So, I figure I'll go ahead and do the topic of it. So, it's called, Love Don't Cost a Thing. It's kind of funny how, like, people say that, you know, or put that in a song, like Jennifer Lopez, Love Don't Cost a Thing, you know little song right but when you think in reality love does cost a lot like especially when it comes to relationships um women and men relationships gay relationships you know whatever love costs and sometimes it costs more than you think it does sometimes it could be your heart um heartache, uh, physical, mental, um, you know, or it can be material, materialistic. Either way, <clears throat> in fashion form, love does cost. Like breakups. You end up losing, somebody break up with you or the relationship didn't work out right. Guess what you end up with cost? Your heart the pain the days and dealing with the emotional dilemma you know of trying to cope with this person not being in your life or vice versa it, it still costs you something you know emotional physical mental material and but when you think about it it's like <clears throat> When you get in a relationship and you start to get married, like, with this person, and you don't realize how much love does cost, like, who, the rings that you women pick out is, some women want these big, gigantic kind of rings, like, <clears throat> well, I didn't know it was a price going for marriage, you know, if somebody's going to propose to you that there's a price tag of how much you need to spend on their rank and my thing is that's too much now that's love costing you know what I'm saying if you love me that a lot as you say you do you would buy I am worth this rank I am worth it twenty hundred or fifty eight hundred dollar ring or almost a thirty five thousand dollar ring you know <laughs> what Look here, I'm being, put my format, <clears throat> swag on this, I don't care how much I could love you, but if I love you enough, I don't care if it's a $56 ring, it came with love, but like they say, love don't, don't cost a thing, but it does, if you're putting a price tag on how much you want somebody to spend or in the show how much they love you for engagement ring, I mean, as a, as men, we don't get no budget on our ring. Hell, we I think we buy our ring when we buy their ring. I mean, do we see women buying our rings for? Now think about it. If we flip the script on some women that are like this, you know, that are very much high maintenance, um, very out there, divalistic or divalicious they can they need to have a Beyonce ring and they're nowhere near Beyonce level you know and you don't make Beyonce money you know what I'm saying we ain't up on Jay-Z level but you don't see, what if we was to step like we trade places and be like them just for once to be like oh this ain't good enough we want a better I want my ring to be this way I want my ring to be cut this way I want it to be mowed this way um, you know, 
I want my rain to um, gleam or whatever you want to call it gleam bling I want my friends to see it from a distance so when they when they I walk up in a place the whole sky is lit up because of my rain you know what I'm saying then But in the aspect of you thinking about it, think of it in that way. Let a man treat you the way you treat us. Like if you flip the wall and see how much your love costs. Women, y'all love costs a lot. You don't think it doesn't? You think, oh no, my love don't cost a lot. But it does. Some women are high maintenance. Very high minutes, and them are the bitches I don't like. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm gonna be real on it. I don't like you bitches. I don't like y'all motherfucking, fucking high maintenance assholes. I don't like y'all asses. You're too fucking materialistic, bitch. If you want a fucking ring that costs almost thirty five thousand dollars for an engagement ring, you need to get your ass in gear and pay for that shit yourself. And then when you do, marry your fucking self because can't no man on my level or with my budget is going to spend that damn much money on you. I'm not going to do it. And no man should have to spend that much fucking money on a fucking ring that it's only one time. You know what I'm saying? What do I look like? If I'm going to spend $35,000 on an engagement ring or almost near to $156,000 for an engagement ring, bitch, when we get a divorce, I want my shit back. I'm making payments. Uh, that's the way I feel on it. Love shouldn't cost a whole lot of damn money just to show how you care about somebody or how you should feel. But there is a lot of high maintenance women. And I don't like y'all hoes. I don't. I don't like you bitches. Because... Nobody can be is if you that high maintenance, then nobody can be on the level that you want that you're seeking. Unless you're a baller, you selling something, you rapping, or you on all these reality TV shows. You know what I'm saying? And when you're on a budget level, you that's when you embrace it, like. Just somebody spending a little bit of money, you, it should make your heart just putter. It shouldn't be like, oh, you didn't spend this much money on my ring, or you didn't spend this much money on the wedding, or your tuck. Um, what? Yeah. But yeah, that's, that's, um, that's what I'm getting at on that. I don't, I don't know. There's a lot of high level women out here that think they are above their budget, you know? And, um, I just don't understand when love should is putting you in a you you can't make your car payment because you gotta make this <laughs> this engagement ring payment because it's what your woman wanted but how much should you you know when it comes to men you know we don't be like that much serious on our ranks you know we, we kind of cherish what you give us for all female Y'all, y'all kind of go ballistic with y'all rings, or um, or any kind of gift you get. Well, I hope you bought me this for my birthday. Wow, well, or or guys, rappers buying brand new cars for the women. Um, you better buy that bitch. Uh, fuck, go to the dollar store and get her some some uh, cards and some candy and some stuffed animals from Walmart and put that shit in one of them big ass bags and and um 
and 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 drop maybe two, two, maybe two three hundred dollars in a card, and and here you go. But buying these chicks brand new fucking cars just because you got money, you know, why blow it like that? If you got already five six cars, you don't need like two extra cars just because she's her birthday or because it's her anniversary or whatever. You want to drop and get her a, a brand new car. Man, fuck that shit. Get me a brand new car. Men, we don't get, we get the short end of the stick. <laughs> like, we get what they give us. And still be happy with it. But let us give a woman just something small. And we think it means so much in a big way. Yeah. That's when we hit that, that whole nagging shit. I just don't get it. I didn't realize love was expensive. Or is expensive. If you think about it, love really is. You, they want something for Valentine's Day, Christmas, their birthday, anniversary. <clears throat> you know? I don't know. What happened to just giving love and that mean a whole lot? Now it's got a price tag on it. <clears throat> I mean, for real. It's got a major price tag on it now. Love, you cost a lot. <laughs> but, um, yo, it's your man Kamari, aka Reno Some Motion. Hey, I drop your thoughts. You know what I'm saying? I'm always open to hearing your opinions and stuff like that, though. Sorry about that. You know, we got dogs. I don't know how to feed them. But, uh, yeah, I just want to get that video out while it was hitting me. Alright, deuces, y'all. Cool. Folks. Oh, yeah, don't forget to follow me on Facebook. We know fan page. It's Kumari21. I think. On there. Or well, yeah, y'all get me on there and I'll figure out what my Skype from the Uvo is in a minute. But uh, yeah, I'll hit you guys up later. Deuces.